Hey Keith, I've been thinking about this quarter panel. Rather than cutting out this section, why don't we just hammer and dolly this? Is that something we can do? That's not a problem. Uh, it's, somebody's been in here before, they've got a little bit of a, a slide hammer thing happening here. It seems to be the amateur way to do it. Uh, I don't think there's going to be a problem with dollying this out. But that's really not, this is the least of the problems. We've got problems in the trunk here. Okay. <laughs> Well, we knew we had a bunch of holes here, so what do you think? We'll buy uh, an entire trunk pan from year one, but are we going to use the whole trunk pan? Uh, we won't use the whole trunk pan. What we're going to use is uh, only what we have to have. I'd rather save the spot welds, try and save as much of the original panel as we can. It's, yeah. uh, it's better that way as far as I'm concerned. So what are you thinking? Just cutting it right around the edges here? Yeah, we'll pick a nice place that's easy to finish, uh, easy to repair the weld, and so you won't see it on the top or the bottom. We're gonna... Keith, on the quarter panel here, it's not too bad. We've got a couple options. We can buy a quarter panel, just cut out that section, but or we could make another panel, but we got a little problem. Mark's coming in a couple of minutes. A couple of minutes? A couple of minutes. Oh, great. Well, all I have to do is measure the panel, then I'll shear a piece to size, and mark out the two straight bends that have to be bent, and roll it, bend the angles. Uh oh, bend that panel again. Now we're going to put a detail in the rocker panel where there's a drain. Weld up the seam. Finish it off real pretty. Fit the panel, scribe the line. Make the wheel lip. Shrink it, stretch it, shrink it, stretch it. Hammer in the reveal on the outside of the fender well. Make a pretty job. Make sure it fits nice. And... Couldn't you do that any quicker? Well, I probably could have done a little bit quicker, but we wanted to do a good job. And it does look mint, actually. Mark will be happy with that. So what do we got left? Well, next we're going to scribe a line across the top of the panel, make sure that we've got a nice clear line to follow, and we'll remove the old piece underneath, we'll cut it off with a cutoff wheel across the top, and make sure that this edge is nice and the panel fits into place perfectly. Then we're going to plug weld the two ends in along the wheel lip, and we'll put a spot weld back in there to make it look correct so that we don't lose the, the authenticity and the integrity of the panel. And we'll plug weld the bottom part in across the bottom of the rocker panel, be careful not to mark our nice little drain that we put in the bottom of the panel for detail and then we'll go ahead and we'll finish the weld and then we'll just prime it just make it perfect that's good enough well we always do yeah i'll stall mark and you finish it off how's that okay 